keep dreams away from me. But then you don't feel more that way. No, I can't focus on anything. I mean, even now, I, I see and hear and feel the way I feel, but everything feels so strange. But all those illustrations I gave you, didn't they help illuminate your dreams? Yes, they only multiply everything ten times. Now, instead of merely seeing stockings, I am plagued by Lady Majora and... Here we are, tea. Air Stiefel, how are you? Uh, very well, thanks, Dr. Moore. Yes? Just saying, Mom. Moore's just off of reading all through the night. Oh, uh, kind of reading Greek. You've got to take better care of yourself, Moritz. Surely your health is more important than ancient Greek. What books have you got there, Melchior? Her spouse, actually. Really? At your age? You're so beautiful, Mom. Uh, so haunting. Still, I should have thought. Well, you boys are at an age now to decide what's good for you and what is not. If you need anything else, call me. Well, your mother certainly is remarkable. Until she catches her son named Goethe. Well, I, I think she's referring to the story of Gretchen and the Italian child. Yes! See how everyone obsessively fixes on that story? It's as if the entire world were mesmerized by penis and vagina. Okay, well, I am. <laughs> This essay that you gave me, you wrote about the female. I can't stop thinking about it. This part, for example. Is that true? Absolutely. No, but how do you know that about you? What the woman must feel? Giving yourself over to someone else. Defending yourself until you surrender and feel heaven break over you. I just put myself in her place. Imagine. Really? Where I go, when I go.